I think it, it is actually very reasonable to pick the Suns to win, even relatively easily. But we've seen the Clippers a couple times already in um, the playoffs have their backs against the wall, 2-0 against Dallas, 2-0 against Utah. Even though they were winning 3-2, losing Kawhi Leonard, how does that affect them? And they answered every time. They have good players like Paul George, Terrace Mann, and Reggie Jackson. So it's it's not as easy to write off the Clippers as it seems, even though it seems, they like said, easy. But I think, again, we don't know if Kawhi Leonard will make um, uh, an appearance in this series. I think it depends on how far the Clippers really can push the Suns because they haven't played a team as good as the Suns to the playoffs. I know Utah were the one team, but I always thought the Suns were actually a better team than them. So that being said, I think it's going to come down the wire. I'm going to go barely Suns in seven. I think it's going to be that close. I, I know it's risky. I know I know it's risky because I feel like the Suns could easily win four. They could sweep them, but I feel especially with Kawhi being out, maybe the, the Clippers just lose confidence. Their morale is shattered, but I think I don't know. I feel like the Clippers will win a couple games. They will. They won't go down easy, but I think the Suns are just too good. I think they're the best team in the um, left in the playoffs. So for that reason, we're going to go with Phoenix and seven. Go with Phoenix and seven. Who would have thought you'd ever be saying that? I know. <laughs>